The Alfred Mann Foundation has unveiled implantable myoelectric sensors that can help a patient control a prosthetic limb by reading the wearer's residual muscle movements. Staff Sergeant James Sides lost his right arm in an explosion in Afghanistan. Now he's the first patient to test a myoelectric prosthetic hand. Tiny wireless sensors about 16 mm long are embedded directly into the residual muscles of the amputee's limb. They detect the signals that travel from the brain to the muscles and control specific movements. The signals are captured and sent wirelessly from the sensors to a decoder box which translates them into the intended movement in the artificial limb. The system allows for three degrees of movement, opening and closing of the hand, rotation of the wrist 180 degrees clockwise and counterclockwise, and lateral movement of the thumb, allowing the patient to easily perform daily tasks. Future systems will include up to 13 angles of motion and pre-programmed patterns, much like touch bionics eye-limb myoelectric hand.